really important to me because I just turned 18 and I've always been really into politics. So it was really exciting for me to get up this morning and be like, oh my gosh, I get to vote today. So it was really exciting. I want to put my voice out there and I want to make sure I'm doing something to contribute where I don't want to like see the outcome, not like it and be like, well, I could have done something. I grew up in Siler Homes, a housing project here. I went on to live in Sunnyside. I currently live in the South Side in the house my grandfather built. And to grow up in the housing projects and become mayor of a city. It's the only way we're going to get the system back to work for us, the people, is if we demand for it to work for us at all levels, especially where we have power, which is locally and states. Well, of course, I'm disappointed. Uh, obviously, the citizens are dissatisfied with the city council and swept out three incumbents. I thought I brought a lot of professionalism and stature to Flagstaff around the state. Did a lot of good things. I'm very happy uh, with the four years that I spent there. I enjoyed it very much. <laughs> electoral votes Trump is ahead at this late stage right there. And let's think about the remaining outstanding states, New Hampshire. 87 percent of the vote is in. Hillary Clinton has a lead now about 3,700 votes. Country.